Do you have more than one social media accounts like two Facebook account or Twitter or Instagram accounts and you want to access both accounts simultaneously? If yes, then you must have seen that in a browser, you are not allowed to access two separate accounts at the same time. You must have to log out from the first account and then only you will be able to log in in the next account. But with the help of Sendwin, we are able to log in into multiple social media accounts at the same time from the same browser without using any kind of incognito or private window. Sendwin made it possible. So my name is Saddam Qasim. I'm your WordPress instructor. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can access multiple social media accounts from the single Google Chrome browser at the same time. So let's jump onto my laptop screen and I can show you how exactly we can accomplish this task. To register with Sendwin services, first of all, you need to open a website that is saddamkasim.com forward slash S-E-N-D hyphen W-I-N that is send hyphen win. This link will take you to the Sendwin official website where you can create a free account. So we are on the Sendwin homepage right now and here you can see the heading future of browsing. Of course, this service can help you to overcome your web browsing challenges. Now let's explore their website. Here they have the Sendwin introductory video which shows how exactly the platform works and what are the features they offer. Underneath the video, it says different browser profiles in a single window. So the idea is clear. With the help of Sendwin, we will be able to use more than one accounts of a common social media platform in a single browser window. We don't have to open the incognito or private window again and again. Here we have a list of all the features they provide in their services like share session across devices, bookmark sessions, sessions page protection, etc. Now let's jump on their pricing plans. They offer three plans. The first one is of course free, whereas the other two are premium plans. Firstly, let's start with a free plan. Click on the sign up button and then create a free account with any of your active email account. Simply flip this form. And do not forget to use the referral code that is VLZW86VM. So this is the referral code. Once you fill up the entire form, then simply click on register. I already have an account with this send.win website. So I'm just going to log in into my existing account. Now remember, it is very important that you must have to use this extension, this website on the Google Chrome browser only because right now send.win has the facility available only on the Google Chrome browser and Microsoft Edge browser. So right now I am on the Google Chrome browser. I'm just going to log in into my account. Okay, so this is the dashboard. Now at the very top, you must be seeing this button, install Chrome extension. Just click on it. Now it's time to install this free extension on your Google Chrome browser. So simply click on add to Chrome, then add extension. Okay. It is really not necessary to synchronize. So just close this pop-up and we have successfully installed and activated this SendWin Chrome extension into our browser. Now here, this is the extension icon, or you can simply click on these three little dots, then go on to this more tools. And here we have the extensions option. Let's click on it. So in the new tab, we are seeing this one send win. It is right now active. Make sure do not disable it. Just enable it. Then only it will work. Now after that, here we are seeing this icon. Just click on it. And here we can see send win. Now this option is available over here. That means it is working fine with our browser. It's time to log in into one of my Facebook account. So I'm just closing this tab and opening the Facebook account. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to log in into one of my original account that is with the name only Saddam. That is the username. Let's log in. So I have to authenticate my account. Okay, so now I have successfully logged in into my account. Now after logging into your account, the next step is you need to click on this extension icon. And then here we have this send win option. Click on it. Now it's time to click on this stored session button. Let's click on it. It will ask you to give a name. So here we can give it a name just like my main Facebook account. Okay. This is just for your reference. And here we can create a group just like Facebook. Then click on add. Okay. Now again, it will ask you to log in into your account. So let's click on login once again. Okay. Again, I need to verify my account. Okay, now let's click on continue. 
I can close the first tab, I mean the previous tab. Alright, now I have successfully logged in into first account that is one of my primary Facebook account. Now it's time to log in in a different account as well. So I'm going to open a different Facebook account in a new tab. Now firstly let's open facebook.com. Okay, so obviously it will open my existing account. Here I have to log out first. Okay, now it's time to log in in the second account. So that is with the email address saddam.onlinecourse1 at gmail.com. So I have created this account just for explaining this entire process. Let's log in. Okay, now it's time to click on this icon again and then click on send win. Okay, this pop-up comes up. Now click on this stored session button. Here we can give it a name just like my second FB account and we can select the same group that is Facebook. So let's select this one and then click on add. Okay, then this account will again ask you to log in. Let's click on login. Close the previous tab. Okay, now I have logged in into my another account with the name Arman. Now let's go ahead and we can refresh the previous window. I mean the previous tab. Let's refresh it. So here you can see this is one of my primary Facebook account where I have already logged in and in the next tab when I refresh this page, this is the second demo account. So in the same Google Chrome browser at the same time I have logged in in two separate Facebook accounts, I mean two separate social media accounts without using any kind of private window or incognito window. In the same way you will be able to use any of your other social media platforms account like Twitter or Instagram or any other account you have. But remember there is an exception. This extension is not working right now with the Gmail account. The Sendwin developers team is already working on their Sendwin extension to make it compatible with the Gmail. But right now it's not working with the Gmail or Gmail related products. I hope you get an idea how exactly we can use multiple social media accounts at the same time in the same browser. If this video was helpful, please do not forget to hit the like button, subscribe this channel and if you want me to make a specific video on your topic, just let me know in the comment section. Till then thank you so much and have a wonderful day.